if you look inside, you'll see the, the base is actually an old aluminum bladder that's been cut into sections that fit. And then you've got plywood, two by twos. And if you look inside, the inside is all lined with rigid insulation that's mirrored on the one side to help attract the heat. There's a small camper in there, and if you want to stick your head in for a half a second, you can find out how warm this gets. And then there's a little camp toilet in behind. And then this folds down into a bed, and there's a storage shelf up on top. I can relate a little bit more to this than I can a 30-story apartment building. Because when I walk into a 30-story apartment building, and I'm dealing with a population in that building, that's 10 to 15 times the size of the village I came from. That's, you know, a little bit of, again, that's another sort of setback where you're becoming overwhelmed. Okay. City is just finding out. So we're sort of going, surprise, guess what we've come up with? And our concern is somebody's gonna sit there and immediately look for everything that's wrong with it rather than finding out how they can use it and build on it. The way that uh, things are going and, and you know, um, the, the lack of, of units, uh, you know, the, the changes in, in the uh, rental, um, rental rates, of course, uh, it's going to get worse before it gets better.